Hey, what is up you guys? This is Leah from Shadow Tutorials. Welcome back for a new video. So today I'll be showing you how to enable sound in safe mode. Um, so this works from Windows Vista to Windows 10. Uh, I'm not sure about Windows XP, but you can try anyway. Um, all right, so as you can see here, if you look at my uh, tray, uh, my speakers are working and this usually doesn't work um, in safe mode. Uh, you should have like a red cross on it but mine works, so I'm going to show you how to do that. So the first thing you want to do is uh, hit the Windows key and we're going to open up the device manager. So just type in devmgmt.msc. Then just click on it. Then you want to scroll down to sound, video, and game controllers. And then just click on your sound device, so this is mine. Double click. Then you want to go to details. And in property right here, you want to scroll down until you see driver key. And what you want to do is just right click and copy the value of that key. Now you can close this and you're going to open up a new text document. And you want to paste your key in that text document. Now what you have to do, uh, as you can see I've already done it here, you, want, you first want to remove the slash and the four zeros at the end. And then you want to turn every lowercase letter into a capital letter like I've done right here. Uh, once you've done that, you can go ahead and copy that new key. So let's minimize this and uh, once you're done, type in the Windows key again and then you're going to type in reject it. Open it up. Now once you open it up, you want to go to H key local machine, system, control, and scroll down to save boot and then open up network. So now you want to right click network, go new key, and you want to rename that key by pasting the code that you just copied. And then hit enter. Now you make sure you're in that uh, key and double click on default right here. And you've got the value data. So you want to rename that to sound comma space video and game controllers. So copy exactly what I just wrote, then click OK. And now you're going to go all the way back to uh, network. So to the network key and you're going to create three new keys. So new key. So the first one will be audio endpoint builder. Hit enter. Now double click on default and change the value data to service. Hit enter. Now create a second key that you're going to rename all in capital letters MMCSS. And then same thing, double click on default and type in service in the value data. And then last key you have to create is audio SRV. And don't forget to type in service in the value data. And that is all guys. All you've got to do now is just restart your computer in safe mode and uh, you will have the sound working. If you're on Windows 10 and you're not sure how to reboot it in safe mode, make sure you click on the link right now. It's a tutorial on how to reboot Windows 10 in safe mode. Thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!